Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to mine and Miss Lucy's stream of Baldur's Gate 3. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. Go ahead and say hello, Lucy. Hello. All right. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. I know... We are starting earlier today. Go ahead and get the uh, game screen on. I know we're starting a little earlier today um, on the weekend uh, with Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, but yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, let's go ahead and load in. Your controller is already hooked up, Miss Lucy. Or insane girl, as it says up there. <laughs> it's true, it's true. Sorry, just trying to fix the mic, make sure that she's got enough room. Hey, Chaos, what's up, man? Everything's going good. Everything is going good, right? I'm doing good. How are you doing, man? <laughs> Words, what are they? What do they even mean? They're like letters and stuff, right? Oh, you lead the way. Oh, wait, hold on. Before we go any further, multiplayer. I gotta give you a Starion here. Alright. Where is the Starion, by the way? Oh, he's back there. <laughs> he doesn't want to follow you. children here, you fool! We was running for our lives. You let them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too? Unbelievable! Uh, oh... Oops, I just got into some dialogue. Lucy, you want to come over here? And I didn't realize that. Hey, can you hit L2 real quick? I want to see something. Go down, press down on the D-pad. Yeah, hit X. See, join conversation. Hit X. Boom. Ah, look at that. We're figuring shit out together. How awesome is that? We need a round of applause for me and you. We're so smart. Oh, you yeah. okay? <laughs> that was smart. Uh, man, I'm sorry. I did not mean to get into the dialogue, babe. I, I really wanted you to uh, do it. So go ahead and pick what you would say in my place. I would. I, I can't. You can't. All right, fine. I'll I'll pick what I say, and it's gonna be as a bard and persuasion. <sighs> oh, what's unbelievable is how we beat the goblins. Am I right? Both of you heroes, man. Um, I'm gonna use guidance. Wonder if I can use advantage too. Holy fuck, moly! I can. I think I got this. I definitely do. <laughs> uh. Oh, nice. How's that going? How was first off? How was work? And uh, how is shopping going, man? Critical success. Hello, the hell success. are you again? Show some respect. This man saved your pathetic life. Well, I didn't ask for any goddamn help. Please, you were begging me to open the gate. Anything to save yourself, you coward! The human's eye twitches. He's about to blow. <laughs> oh, shit. Um... Damn, both my persuasion and intimidation are pretty good. About the same, actually. They are the same. Uh, I'm gonna say more violence won't bring back won't bring back those you lost. Stop and thank both of you. Damn those persuasion rolls. It's because I'm a bard. That's it. That's the only reason why. You're right. There's too much at stake. Worried about your precious eyes, the both of you. Enough. Squabbling is pointless. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. 
No, not yet. I really do want to play uh, Dying Light 2. I've just, I've been busy. I've been trying to work on some videos, and then I did, uh, while well, you were there, um, I did a stream not too long ago. But I, I promise I will get on to playing some Dying Light uh, 2 so that we can, uh, so we can play together. At least you're done with work though, right? May have been boring, but I'm gonna let you go first. You you lead the way because apparently I get caught into conversations when I do. You should be faster anyways. You got longer legs. Look at these short stubby things. <laughs> I, I will get I will uh get into uh, some dying light too though really soon. I'm sorry it's been taking me so long. Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met, and thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Man, I gotta say, before you say anything, or go any further, I gotta say, there was an update that just happened, like, a day or two ago for Baldur's Gate 3 um, on the PS5, and I feel like the graphics are loading in a little faster, like, the pop-in textures, you're not seeing, like, the face have to render in is, is long, so I think, well, I mean, I have been playing this game for a minute now, <laughs> just little things that I've been noticing. They did a good job, I think, on um, the graphics in the PlayStation 5 version. All right, sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt. Go ahead. Um, what ritual are you talking about? Ah, I forgot. You're a blow-in. A few days hence, this grove will be completely concealed by thorny vines. None will be able to enter or leave. A drastic measure. But more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. Oh, nice. Heck yeah, dude. I'll definitely want to uh, try Woodruids that axe out. Be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well, may Sylvanas guard them as they continue their travels. said the region's overrun by monsters they won't survive by themselves as i said it's a drastic measure but the survival of the grove is paramount there just aren't enough supplies to support everyone oh uh, well i'm looking for a healer i pray no goblin arrow has grazed you netty could put you to rights she should be with the others in the inner chambers but i doubt she'll be taking on new patients the grove will be locked down soon. All right, well, what are you selling, I guess? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. I'm going to let you do your thing and level up my characters here while you're doing that. No one stops Hopefully me. Hopefully that yet. doesn't mess with you. Nice. Strangers over us. Get uh, six health. Not what I said. And level shouting? one and two spell slot. No? Those are the axes when you throw them, they'll uh, come back to you, right? Um, I need to fix that. I'll fix that later. Not gonna worry about it right now. Let's see. Cloud of Daggers, that's super OP. Um, Please. I could I do sleep. Sleep is a good one kill. to have too. Uh, 
animal friendship. I... I don't know. I'll have to think on this one to see if that's something. Phantasmal Force. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's an illusion spell. I think I'm going to get Thunder Wave. I care about our lives. Our future. Yeah, Thunder Wave's pretty good. No, you just care about your stupid but so is... Take that back. Right. Hmm. Yeah, let's do Thunder Wave. And... I'm gonna let you do the majority of the fighting. I think I'm either gonna do College of Lore or College of Valor. College of Valor, I can buff you more. College of Lore, I'm gonna be able to do... Um, I think more magic. Yeah, I think College of Lore is gonna be able to do more magic. That doesn't matter. Hmm. Of course it does! You would choose strangers over I'm gonna us. go with lore. That's not what I said. Can we stop shouting? No? Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? <laughs> Is this not why you are here? Thank you for subscribing, by the way, Lean Fox. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Um, am I gonna do what uh, with the video that you sent me? Or Calm down. like, which video are you talking about? Is what I'm saying. Oh, I can assign some proficiencies. Let's see, stealth, man, side and hand. That I'm gonna leave to you. So, let's do... I can't do history. History's already good. Um, perception. That's a good one to have. I'd like to do performance, but it's already... Persuasion. I don't know. I'm going to let you worry about that. And then we'll do survival and one more i think oh yeah i can't do history so i think religion i'll go with next sylvanas guide your path um sure acrobatics can stay what's the other one Performance? Yeah, but the those can stay. Those are good to have. Um, speak with animals. Keep it. Man, both of those are good. I'm not getting rid of one. Oh, you got speak with animals too? I didn't even notice that. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, yeah. You get to choose what kind of barbarian you're going to be. You can also go down, babe, if you want. And then hit R3 to see like what Frenzy and Frenzied Strike do. That way you can make a better decision. Not that you're making bad decisions, I'm just saying. I'll shut up. <laughs> uh, in the dungeon? No, I'm not going to use any, like, um, little tricks and stuff like that. Not when uh, Lucy's playing because uh, it's her first go-round. So I'm just kind of letting her um, have an adventure while I tag along. Uh, so, no, I'm not going to do any of that. Um... Let's see, calm emotions. 
Nah, that's not really that big of a deal. Or is this just telling me, oh, I've acquired. Okay, yeah. Um, I was about to say paladins. Clerics kind of just acquire their uh, stuff. Their spells. Cure wounds. I don't know. I've never liked this spell. Because you have to be right next to your um, homie to cast it. Let's see. Command. Command is actually pretty good. Uh, for now, I'm just going to take off Shield of Faith. I'm not really using it. And I'm going to put Lesser Restoration on here. Or... Oh, okay. Nope. This is what we're doing. Oh, what am I doing? Okay, there we go. This is about your precious border gate. I care about our lives. Our futures. So no, real quick. You just care about your stupid apprenticeship. Take that back. Right now. Do I have I do. There we go. We got pretty much a free short rest. Yeah. So now we can continue on. Uh let me go over to Shadowheart. I'm gonna buff our party. She just got uh warding bond which is going to give an ally which you uh until long rest okay Allow me. now your armor class will be boosted that's what that square is around you that doesn't matter of course it does you would choose strangers over us. Mm, I don't have long strider. Oh yes, I do. Stop shouting. See what you're hiding. And then I'll give. Uh, he's too far. I'll give him a long strider. Now you can move further. Oh, did it not go on yours? Okay, yes it did. Yep, you got long strider. It just because it exited out like the long strider. I don't know why. The white is getting to me. I think you get ten Before extra man, meters for long strider. For Let me check real quick. Calm down, please. Yeah, ten feet. I won't leave them behind. You're going All right, to get us you killed. lead the way. Get some stuff done. Let's talk to some people. Yeah, Bonk some goblins in the head. <laughs> yeah. Looney Tunes them. Again. Swing and swing. Take your time. Get a feel for it. I swear that Ox's gaze is following me. The ox. This is about your precious board escape. <laughs> I run so good, huh? Take your time. Yeah. Get a feel for it. Elbows high. Now pull back and swing. Just gotta go up to him, talk to him. Hit X. Pels, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blazing spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Or yell louder. That's fine too. Only cowards run from a fight. How dare you! Prove <laughs> her wrong then. If you think you're able to, that is. <laughs> Sug! Fine. We'll stay. If we survive, it'll make for a good story, I suppose. 
Thank you, Roland. Nice. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? Good work, kids. <laughs> You're all True. heroes. Each and every one of you. Again. Swing and swing and parry. And, and again. Swing Go and on. swing and... Make me proud. No helping it. We're exposed now. Ain't leaving sound for a good while after this. Good to be back behind the walls, have to say. For as long as that lasts. Don't make me hurt you, boy. Too late! Looking at you is painful enough! Just letting you do your thing for a moment. I'd die if I met the Roland. Lee and Roland would never admit it. But they take an arrow for the other. Also stab each other. Not sure what will come first. Thanks for cutting in. There might have been more than words if you hadn't. Take me. What I wouldn't do for better talk. Ah, uh, if it isn't the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you came along when you. Oh. There isn't a bit of color in those cheeks, Pickle. Are you harsh? Cold? Feverish? Auntie Ethel will sort you out. I've lotions and potions galore. What are you, an alchemist? Oh, nothing as fancy as that. But I come from a long line of women with a dab hand at such things. Aha! You take a sup of that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. And what is this exactly? Oh, it is just a healing potion. Nothing fancy. Here. You just look like you might need a pick-me-up. I'm sorry to go on about it, but are you all right? You're looking awful peaky. I'm fine. Just a uh, bone worry after a difficult day? Oh, stop! Even on a good day, half the camp acts like a bunch of screaming brats. I'm tempted to smack them all on the backside <laughs> and tell them to kiss and make up. Not that they'd listen to little old me. Anyway, do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. What's the harm? Show me your wares. Hey, bother. What, kids? You're all here. Yeah, I'm the same way, Chaos. I am not a shopper. Don't you lie to me, boy. I know you have it. Touch me and I'll bite your fingers off. Oh, you I know will. What? I haven't checked what I have in my inventory. I don't think I have much. I have a few things. I'd die if I met the rogue and reeking of this place. Right. What am I to never get the smell out of my clothes. Water. My dagger. Um, Burn them. Shadow heart has plenty of stuff. I'm gonna send that to you. Hope the road isn't too bad. Send that to Hells take me. What I wouldn't do for better to Give it back, kid! I already Hell told you I bad. don't have it! How um, stupid are you? I'm gonna send all this stuff to you to sell if you want. Sorry, I know that you just uh, sold some stuff. Um, what is this? <laughs> I couldn't even read that if I wanted to. <laughs> Good luck on anybody watching stream reading that shit if I can't read it. <laughs> I'm gonna send you this book. Good luck on reading it, babe. <laughs> Hope the goblins aren't smart enough to poison their blade. Oh, what 
Um, yeah. Don't you lie to me, boy. I know you have it. Touch me and I'll bite your fingers off. I will. Oh, you know what? That's what I need to do. Damn druids. Who uses what? <laughs> the odds in our favor don't mind me i'm just buffing you to hell and back oh wow it got protection from good and evil okay well now i don't have it <laughs> because i gave it to you but i'd rather you have it true you're the main damage to it i already told you i don't have it it's because it's a concentration spell where did i put that in the bucket well when you do concentration spells, you can only concentrate on one spell at a time. So that's why I, it, like, I cast it on myself, thinking, oh, yeah, blah, 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 blah. I should have uh, read that it was a um, concentration spell. Yep. See, but down there, it'll tell you concentration. See, down at the bottom left. Concentration. I'd die if I met the rogue and reaching of this place. Evil. Never get this. Don't you lie to me, boy. I know you have it. Touch me and I'll. Me and Roland would never admit oh, it. I did not mean to in. click on that. Oh yes, I can. Stay back, or else. You gonna jump into the. L L2 and then you gotta go over to my picture um why do you want me to stay back what's wrong nothing's wrong just get back Ow! oh my tooth um mind if I take a look at that it's the front one I chipped it on the evil thing uh, uh, were you trying to eat it or something? Maybe. I didn't think it would bite me back. Wait, you're big. You can get rid of the evil thing. Follow me, but be ready for anything. A avocado jalapeno drink? That sounds disgusting. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That does not sound like anything I would ever drink. Right. Chaos. <laughs> I mean, I like avocados. No, I like jalapenos, but I like no, them haven't. not in a drink. <laughs> Maybe in a taco. <laughs> Easy money. <laughs> You're like that makes two of us, bud. How long do you think we've got before the goblins come? Oh, <laughs> okay. True. That was quick dialogue. <laughs> Goblins, druids, this grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. Good advice, lady. I already told you I don't have it. The Blade of Frontiers. What a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart, too. The future's in good hands. Good work, kids. You're all heroes. Each and every one of you. Go on. Give me a best shot. So we're... Probably Not bad. stream to like 5.30, right? Again. Okay. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this.
Good advice, child. You do well to listen. Hmm. <laughs> You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your sh The man's smile bends downward, and his thoughts become yours. You are the Blade of Frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe held high. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Another sneaky? Thank the gods. You know the friends I can get. Better friends than the ones hitching a ride in our skulls, at least. I'm sure you know the stories. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid. They say there's no coming back. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Devil's advocate? Do you think she'll bring the blood war? Balance? They rune. They rune. They yep. That ship sailed the sticks already. All I can hope for is to limit the damage. Her name is Karlak, an archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship, but the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her, she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. I'm looking to cure this infection. I suggest we partner up. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath bound to go after her. But I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. You'll need to make room if you want to partner up, though. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. Yeah, you can go back to camp. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. What nice. Right, sir? Will's at our camp. Right, He's can. a really good uh, warlock. Can. Pretty powerful. Okay. So if you're wanting to yeah. maybe... Like, ah, I don't feel like having a rogue in my party. I, I want to check out what a warlock can do. Or even a wizard. Because if you want no. to play around with magic, you can and control again. either of those guys too. Swing you know? You don't have to oh. have... Um, uh, Astarion in the party if you don't feel like it. Wizards have a lock picking, lock picking spell, you know. There's always a way around something, you know. Don't ever feel like you're stuck with one character to have as a party member. True. Unless it's me, and you're just stuck with me. Can't keep the goblins oh, and, and Shadowheart, because she doesn't no come out of the party. And we're no warriors. <laughs> don't yeah. judge me, babe! <laughs> Oh, sorry. <laughs> Hitting the mic. <laughs> uh. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. You want me to talk to the ox? Well, sure. Yeah. Is it? Oh, look at that. You can check in there. You can open it with R1 to see what's in the pouch. Oh. Or wait, no, that's no, that's, no, that's yours. Uh, go to press square. Uh, open down there. Yeah, my bad. Now you can hit R1 if you're like, oh, well, I don't want all of that 
where you can just take it all. Seduce the dragon! <laughs> uh, shit. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I mean, I am playing a bard, so... <laughs> it's possible. But <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and talk to the strange ox. Ah, you're addressing me? A Gotta humble hit L2. ox. How quaint. Uh, I don't think I have anything into Arcana. We'll see. May the dice roll in our favor. Oh, I got Jack of all trades. What does that do? Your vast experience makes you more likely to succeed in any undertaking and half your proficiency bonus. Nice. All right. That's pretty dope. Not going to lie. <laughs> I just made it. Okay. <laughs> uh, good thing I had those bonuses. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. Um, there's more to you than meets the eye. Can you care to explain? No. You are incapable. Transformer? Okay, stop. <laughs> uh, come on, old chap. I'm a devil for gossip. Nah, I'm just a devil in general. Get advantage. Oh, damn. That was close. I'll tell you this much. I'm going to Baldur's Gate, with or without the rest of these poor sods. Now, that's all I have to say besides, and I really mean this, move. <laughs> Nothing <laughs> here for Funny. you. Not yet. Not yet. We, well, we, we do know about the squirrel, yes. <laughs> but we haven't been over to the squirrel yet. Should we go oh, over to the squirrel? Oh, you have um, me, yeah, up where the guy that you sold stuff I to is past him. Oh, the waiting's getting to me. If we left, we could at least make a run for it. We gotta keep going this way. Well, yeah, but I just didn't know if. <laughs> I mean, if you really want to, <laughs> I wonder. I wonder if I kick him, if it'll be like. A softer kick. <laughs> uh. Gotta hit L2. Get out! The squirrel lunges at your foot and bites it. <laughs> uh, what was that for? You're trespassing. This is my territory. Uh, actually, I think there's plenty of room for the both of us. <laughs> Probably bites the shit out of my neck. <laughs> nice. By the way, whenever you have an advantage on anything, you roll two D twenties. How about this? You can stay if you keep those ugly feet on the ground. I'll even sweeten the pot. Found some weird smelling stuff on the ground. You can keep it, but these trees are mine. Follow the rules and I won't have to intervene. Got it? <laughs> oh, nice. She gave us a null ear or a hyena ear. Cool. That's for potions of speed. I'm going to be tossing potions at you like crazy, babe. You just wait. You just wait. I've already been tossing spells at you. What's with the uh, red stuff around her? I don't know, but uh, you lead the way. Mm 
Well, let's go check it out. Um, I don't know. Is there? <laughs> One budge. Just following you along. I'm just here for the ride. The good times and the tunes. <laughs> I think I can toss it now. Oh yeah. You can use me as an improvised weapon. Or you can use a goblin as an improvised weapon. That's actually a trophy I gotta do. do. Use a goblin. Or I think it's just any enemy. Do you know how to do improvised weapon? You have to go and hit R1 <laughs> and I believe it is... Right there, improvised melee weapon. Hmm. You pick up like a dead goblin, or you can pick up me. Um, if you want to throw me, though, you actually have to pick throw, and then you know. Or actually, I think. Hold on. If you hit L three, <laughs> I can pick your pocket. Hit L three and uh, click on me with the reticle. Press square. Uh, I think you're hovered over Shadow Heart. Let me move into a better spot for you. Look, don't take your eyes off my hand. There you go. And then you can throw me. Just don't throw me off any cliffs, please. <laughs> uh, should not give you any ideas, should I? Last room. It's the Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Corga's judgment. Now get back. Oh, let me through, Ragrasham, or I'll rip your damn throat out. <sighs> One day you should really get this game, Chaos. I think you would really like it. You like RPGs, and this is probably Lives are at stake. the best RPG the I've ever played. And cowards only care about their bloody rituals. Damn it. Oh. <laughs> Every single gods. time. I'm, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> by a bear. Talking through your dialogue Trumpets and <laughs> coming in at Peace the very last, last second. Yogi, oh, so yo, haven't seen you in a minute, dog. <laughs> Where's a boo-boo? We're not up. leaving till it's safe. Can do that. We're not scared of you. We could help each other. Fight the goblins together. Instead, these fools are trying to chase us away. She got some gnarly looking horns, doesn't she? <laughs> Carl Magrin, give her a chance. You. Get back! I'm not looking for trouble. Can you just let me by? No, and you'll find trouble all the same unless you get out of my sight. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. You! Apparently, Corga wants to see you. Go ahead. That we could speak freely, my Ursine friend. Alas, I've never learned to converse with your kind. You can always read in the journal, remember. You have a journal right here. Yeah, yes. R2. Quite aware. R2, and then it's to your right. Also, oh, go ahead. <laughs> You're good. But all of that stuff right there, like. Yep. So even there, your inspiration. If you go to your left, uh, you see down where you're next to Shadowheart, be it an acolyte, uh, like so, kind of like religious stuff, you'll get uh, inspiration for. 
the bear. I'd like to back up on the inside of my tutorials and My grizzled friend, what can you tell me about this place? After we talk to this guy, can we go up uh, to the top and talk to the chick with the uh, loot? I kind of want to do that for her, teach her how to do all that. I know we've done that before. Um, it's, it's honestly, it's not that big of a deal either way. It's up to you. Mm hmm You were a druid, too. Okay. Maybe you gotta talk to Volo. Ah, my good friend! You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Not a bad place for uh, um, Smokey the Bear, though. Legit. This place is paradise for some animals, man. Well, that's all right. You can ask your questions. Glory. Now then, how would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Uh, size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. <laughs> I guess I'll give an exact description. Goblins were of a rare gem-colored hue, and wielded magic blowguns. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? Brass? <laughs> uh, no doubt, it's for sure brass. Witness mistook obvious silver dragon for brass. Last question, <laughs> then you'll be asshole. quite free. Did the attackers rally to the Absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yes, they uh, called out the name like a war cry. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one, a captive in this very camp. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. The scandal! Goblin superstition? Not worth the ink and parchment, huh? Ah, but is superstition all? These goblins are informed by a kind of strategy anathema to their kind. I, for one, intend to get to the bottom of it. I'm just preparing to head to their camp as we speak, in fact. If you'll excuse me, I ought not to dawdle. You should probably be careful. Goblins aren't known for mercy. Oh, never you mind. Who needs mercy when you've a quick tongue, hmm? Huh? And an invisibility potion stashed in your back pocket. Until we meet again. Okay. Yes. Yes, I see. <laughs> She must be terrified. I bet she's giving them hell. Kind of want it. Yeah, nope. No. I'm not going to chance it. <laughs> I was going to rob his ass from his, for his invisibility potion, but... <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> Should have stole his notebook. 
<laughs> right out of his hands. Dance upon the stars tonight. Smile when pain will fade away. Words of mine will change. No. Become. Ugh. Um. <laughs> what are you, what did that poor instrument ever do to you? You're butchering it. Uh I'm going to go ahead and sing words of my I'm I have a horrible singing voice, so I'm just going to say what my guy would sing. Words of mine will turn to ash. Words of mine will turn <laughs> to ash when you call the last light down. Um, continue singing. Moon reminds me of your grace. Moon reminds me of your grace. All the love I can't repay. Rest and know that I will pray. Farewell, my dear old friend. Wait, that's it. No worries, take your time, Chaos. I think they did a really good job on this song. It's really pretty. What you think, babe? Sure. You're like, I don't fucking care. <laughs> it actually turned down low because they have the music turned down low. My bad. Thank you. I was having trouble finding the words. Um. You're welcome. Just keep at it. It's been so long since I... Since... Sorry. Damn it. 
Um, it's all right. Let it all out. I don't usually. <laughs> I'm all right. I haven't finished a song since Lihala died. I haven't played at all, if I'm honest. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like an asshole thing to say to her. Um, well, you've come up with a fine tribute to her. Thanks. Lehala made me love music. The sound, the feel, the thrill. But when she died, it was gone. Until now, I'd forgotten what it was like. That itch in my fingers to perfect a song. The Weeping Dawn will be my gift to her. Thank you. I... I needed this. Um, I'm gonna try to talk to her again. It's still rough, but my song is getting there. Oh. Yeah. Oh, this is locked. I don't, I don't think I'll be able to pick that. Could you pick this chest for me? Yeah, I know what's in that chest. That's why I'm like, yeah, I want to come over here and talk to this lady. I should have uh, played my loot with her. That would have been cool, huh? Dance upon the stars tonight. Smile and pain will fade away. Oh, yeah, you got this. <laughs> oh, yeah, you definitely got this. Good job, babe. <laughs> it wasn't a nat 20, but it all added up to a 20, that's for sure. Oh, you're all good. I'm just gonna use that to click on it. Soothing song. When you inspire an ally using bardic inspiration, they also regain 1 to 6 hit points. Pretty dope. Because I try to use bardic inspiration quite a bit on you. Well, on everybody. Although that hat is not very flattering. <laughs> I'm just going to say that now. Oh, you know what? I can also, just a quick heads up. If you're ever like, oh, I don't want to see my hat in cutscenes. You can come right here. Take the tool tip off. It'll be a little better. But you can come up here and you see how there's the eyeball. If you hit triangle, that's to hide it in dialogue. See how it has that little box with an X. And then if you don't want to see it at all, just hit triangle one more time. And that cancels it out all the, all the way. So, there you go. My cowboy hat. I guess I'm not Mr. John Wayne without a cowboy hat, right? <laughs> you can call me the Bardic Cowboy. I'm here to sing you some country tunes, girl. Come here. <laughs> Yeah, right? <laughs> you gonna be able to play the game? <laughs> we got some stepping stones to hop across. I'm too short. <laughs> You're gonna have to do it. <laughs> I'll fall into the river down below. Over here. Or down this way. Oh, shit. I don't have um, Shadow Heart with me. <laughs> I, I just left her ass. There you are. <laughs> singing. Oh, it's beautiful. Maybe all good. You have protection of good uh, from good and evil. You will be just fine.
or you don't have protection from good and evil anymore. I guess concentration is gone. Oh, I might have been concentrating on something else. Such that sucks. A pretty song. You'll be alright though. You have warding bond. You have defense against uh what is it, charmed and all of that. You'll be alright. Because that's what wording bond does, right? Wherever it is. Can't give up now. Such Don't have bardic inspiration, song. so keep that in mind. What's next, I wonder? Please. Um. Mm, no. That's okay. Such a pretty song. Let's get going. Let's get going. Yeah. It's a pretty song. Shh. Listen. Oh, I finally got it. Oh, oops. I didn't think I was going to get into combat. I was just trying to position myself. <laughs> uh, I'm going to die. I'm going to have to leave you. He's got himself in trouble again. Uh, let's see. <laughs> You're singing. Let's. Oh, no, I don't want that on. Let's have some fun. Let's play some music. Let's see. Mm, turn undead. We're not fighting undead creatures. Um. Hey, why did uh, I stop? Singing, or not singing, <laughs> playing uh, my loop. You can always use jump. Don't forget about that. Up on the D-pad if you want to jump. You probably can get pretty far. Do you have your torch out? <laughs> I have a feeling you have a torch in your hand. <laughs> I do. Is there a particular reason? <laughs> you might be able to make it over to the harpy. You can zoom out with the right joystick if it's too. What? I oh, hit um R1. Oh, you must have accidentally pulled it out. Because now you don't have any actions. Okay, so get out of here real quick. Hit R2. Go into your inventory with the helmet. There you go. Um, and you gotta put your you gotta equip your axe. Oh, your axe was right there. Uh, oh, sure. Put that on. Oh, you can't cost an action. 
Damn. All right. <laughs> uh, yeah. Just gotta end your turn. Look to uh, Astarion. Yeah, I don't know what you did there. Sorry. That sucks. Oh, uh, you had held down or? Oh, ouch. You're just supposed to press up on the D-pad to jump. It happens. It's not the end of the world. We're not dead yet. We didn't save, but we're not dead yet. <laughs> You're going to have disadvantage no matter what, unfortunately, unless you move closer. Does he have any movement speed? Yeah, movement. Can he move? Because if you can move him and get him a little closer, he'll, uh, he won't have disadvantage. Didn't move close enough. Oh, there you go. 75% chance to hit that harpy. <laughs> and it was a crit. Two crits. That's awesome. Run, kid, run. Damn, one of them's already almost dead. You see that? Um. Yep. He's dead. Nice. If you can move him closer. Um he uh I got heal wounds. I better heal myself. <laughs> I love how I use my uh loot jam out. Um do the vicious mockery. Nah, they saved. I should have just tried to hit him. <laughs> it's time to eat. Oh, oh. You got uh, attack of opportunity. I believe you can use reckless attack, which will give you... Um, not advantage, but it'll give you a better... Per yeah, it'll give you a better chance at hitting. <laughs> it happens. Oh, he's lured. Ouch. It's alright. I can knock her out of it. Can I shove her? I could. That is... Mm. All right, I'm just gonna go for it. Hopefully I can hit her. I did. Oh, her concentration was successful. You suck, lady. Let's push her. <laughs> I tried my best. <laughs> Run away, kid. <laughs> we apparently cannot save you. <laughs> nice. Missed. That's one good thing about... Uh, weapons that you summon they cannot um, be charmed don't hit me <laughs> leave me alone why are you picking on me um 
Let's... I got another healing word. Yeah, because I'm at 1 HP. Alright. Let's get back to jamming out, everybody. What? Jam? You some bitch? Jam! Ah, oh, he won't do it. Whatever. Doesn't matter. Oh, she's chasing down that kid. You got your hammer on, at least. <laughs> That's a start. The one back there by the kid is the one singing. If you can hit her. That would be ideal. Let's see. Um... I need to heal Mr. Wayne here. He's looking pretty rough. Take care of you. Nice. And then I'll take care of this lady up here if you want to make your way to the so other one. That so that way you don't... You can jump, by the way. Remember, just press up on the D-pad. Don't hold it down. <laughs> uh, you have good movement speed, too, so you can make it. Well, I thought you could make it, but it's all right. Um... Eat shit, Harpy. <laughs> I missed. She's like, oh, you eat shit. Um. Nice. Got that one down. Now my short leg dude is going to try to make it all the way over there. Can I play some music now? to do that cancel that's dumb <laughs> try to make some kind of action it's on you hopefully you can hit her there you go use your reckless attack 88% jump see if we can't fly not enough movement summoned weapons suck with movement they're good they just suck with movement um you know what i'm gonna do i'm gonna throw this spiked ball at her not you <laughs> oops all right. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I broke the concentration. Sorry for the bleeding. <laughs> Thanks. You're welcome. To make it up to you, I will do that. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Even though she hit you. Uh... Um, I'm just gonna throw another fire, uh, bolt at her. whoa, oh, okay. Yeah, <laughs> nice. Uh, are they gone? They're gone now. Are you alright? No. Yes. I mean, I don't know. Take a deep breath. 
will know that you're safe now, okay? Th that's what the voice said. I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get back. Mole will be so mad. <sighs> Wait, um, you should meet Mole. She'll be grateful you helped me. Find a boy called Donny. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. <laughs> Should should we do a long rest after looting? Yeah, I got almost no spell slots left, or no, I don't have any spell slots left. All my spells are used up, and my bardic inspirations used up. Save your thoughts for later. <laughs> Remember, you can always hold down R3, and that will uh, show you some lootable places. Not every time, but, you know. Or you can hit L3, too, and kind of hover over stuff. See if you can't loot them. <laughs> My guy has to sit down to get, get down for places. It's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> I'm starting to like the bard, though. Um, I've never really played a bard. I mean, not in uh, Baldur's Gate. And D&D &D itself I have. But D&D &D and uh, a, like D&D &D tabletop is a lot different than Baldur's Gate 3. I mean, they, they do have, they are very similar, but there's like some different stuff. It's not like tabletop, but it is, if that makes sense. Where did you go? I lost you. Oh, I thought you went this way. My bad. There's a chest over here. Oh, it's empty. I, I grabbed everything. My bad. <laughs> I'm dumb. Don't listen to me. Keep doing what you're doing, Miss Lucy. You're doing great. I am just holding us back. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Over here is the uh, skipping stones I can't uh, hippity hop over to. Good luck. You should be able to get over there, no problem. You had a chance to throw me, by the way. And you didn't take it. <laughs> hey, it's your character. <laughs> Hopefully Astarion can see it. Cause there is a chest over there. Hmm. What's that? Oh, look at that. Good stuff, babe. You can hit I was gonna say you can hit um L three if you're having trouble. So it's like a cursor that you can Use or hold down X a little bit and that'll grab everything too. Everything in a certain vicinity, that is. Nobody. You're doing that. What? What is going on? <laughs> uh, what did, did you break the game? God. I have no clue. We'll save and uh, reload. Maybe that'll fix it. <laughs> we broke Baldur's Gate, everybody. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's give it a save. Just to, uh, you know, just to be safe. You know, never hurts. Okay, I'm like, wait, which one is it? Which one is it? It's not John Wayne, it's Mr. John Wayne. Uh, let's take a uh, long rest. Make haste. I would have words with you. 
Oh, there's somebody that wants to talk to you, babe. Me? Yeah. You don't see him over there? You, you're wearing your camp clothes. My yeah. I'm so stoic. Look <laughs> at me. <laughs> hey, you guys. Be with you in a moment. What was that lizard do? He's made of copper ball. Whatever for? Look at him. Never too much of a good thing, I say. Be that as it may. Ceramorphosis. What does it make you think of? Uh, until recently, uh, nothing at all. Ah, yes. The good old days. Day one, fever and memory loss. Day two, hallucinations and graying skin. Day three, hair loss and blood leaking from all orifices. Need to go on? <laughs> uh, no, thank you. My point is this. Our orifices remain blissfully unblooded, our heads remain clear, and our blood temperature normal. Any expert will agree this is abnormal. Legit. I'm with you, Chaos. <laughs> it was a Neo 2 mimic. Normal. I'll toast to that. The pragmatic in me, however, sees only the silence before the storm. Something to sleep on. We should get some rest. So it's about 5.13. I figured we'll end here soon. That way uh, we can get dinner done and whatnot. Okay? Yeah. All right. I'm following you. Ah, another. Thy name has been recorded. I shall be here in thy camp for whenever thou hast need of my services. Kind of skeleton author. A mending of the threads between life and death. Should thou or any of thy compatriots perish, I will cleave soul to body once more. <laughs> A matter of coin. Did you see the uh, new Fallout TV show trailer, Chaos? If you haven't, you should watch it. It looks really fucking good. But what if I don't have a hamburger? Then I shall wait here patiently until it is acquired. Then, uh... Real quick, uh... he can also help you change your class. If you are not feeling the barbarian class, he can change your class. Nice. Well, I think I'll leave for now, there, homie. Uh, yeah. Make haste. I would There's have more words on with withers. You. Man, you should really watch it. You'd like it. Let's talk to Shadowheart. Come. Hey, girl. How do you feel? Like shit. Uh, I don't know. How do you feel, girl? Better than I ought to. Other than the occasional mental exchange, it's almost as if we're not infected. It's so strange. Do you remember the voice from the ship? Um, uh, what do you mean? What voice? After they put that tadpole in my eye, I heard this voice. 
It was... soothing. The voice said I'd become a beautiful weapon. What do you think that means? That means that you are crazy. Um... Sounds like it had plans for us. Whatever they were, those plans were interrupted by the dragons. Either way, we can't take the lack of what symptoms kind of face for granted. Is that? <laughs> we have to find a healer. Well, I've said my piece. Get some rest. The Blade of Frontiers. Let's hope Will lives up to his name. We'll need all the help we can get. Um, what do you think, uh, no, actually we should get to know each other a little more. Must we? No harm in a little mystery, don't you think? Um, if you're not comfortable talking about it, I guess I won't press you. Thank you. I'm sure we'll get along perfectly well. Uh, what's up with the odd little artifact you're carrying around? There's no story. None that you're entitled to hear, anyway. Just forget you ever saw it. Okay, sure. Did you want to talk to Starion or anything before we... Oh, the nasty face she gave you. And, yeah, she she looked pissed at me. <laughs> I saw you getting a lecture from our magical friend. I have to say, I thought you'd look worse, but no. Not a tentacle to be seen. Well, I hope that it'll stay that way. Naturally. But I was thinking... What if it doesn't? Of course, first sign of change, and I'll have to stop that pretty little heart of yours. <laughs> I am open to suggestions. Knives, poison, strangulation, whatever you'd prefer. <laughs> well, what do you prefer, babe? <laughs> I prefer to be poisoned all the time. So... Don't be so pig headed. I'm being practical. How much damage will you cause if you transform? How much blood can you bear to have on your hands? What if I die? I'm gonna take you with me. <laughs> I do like you, you know. You've got fire. <laughs> Whatever happens. I'll make the right choice. Sweet dreams, darling. <laughs> you can talk to him again. I think he's got more dialogue for you. So, we're traveling with the famed Blade of Frontiers. Death by I feel explosion. safer already. <laughs> tell me about yourself. Oh, what's to tell? I'm a magistrate back in the city. It's all rather tedious. <coughs> Sorry. That was funny, Chaos. Do you know the Muffin Man? The Muffin Man? The Muffin Man! Okay, let's see. We'll just use that for a full rest. Elves and half elves, they don't sleep, they only meditate. Um, there are important matters to discuss. But he's also a vampire, so he just doesn't sleep. <laughs> Let's, um, I think we can get a couple more things done before, uh, we hop off, because it's 521 now. Mm. 
Do you have someone waiting for you in Baldur's Gate, Astarian? A sweetheart, perhaps? Not one in particular. The city is a veritable feast of sweethearts. <laughs> Probably stole something. Astarion? I wouldn't put it past to get him. Back then. Slimmer pickings out in this wilderness. Uh, we still got to meet uh, Nettie and. Um, yeah, Korga, I think her name is. Oh, I can talk to this bear over here. Oh, that's right. Hold on. I forgot to cast this. Speak with the animals. Yeah, just a little bit. I'm sleeping. Uh, could you move just a little bit? Uh, we need to use the elevator that you're sleeping on. <sighs> okay. <laughs> There's a ton of smoking the bears. <laughs> Now we can actually use the elevator to get up and down if we wanted to. Uh, you lead the way. Speak. The bird knows. She needs to know. You do not. Are you serious? They changed Smokey the Bear to a fox? Did not know that. Please, not so loud. I'll tell you, but please don't do that again. More follow Korga every day. They are afraid and she offers a simple solution. Eject the refugees and we will be safe. It searches for news of Master Hulsen. Only he can set this right. If he is gone, well, pray that he is not. Why a fox, though? <laughs> In Batman's voice, where is she? <laughs> uh. He left with the adventurers. They went treasure hunting in an old temple near here. Master Halsin did not chase treasure. I do not know what he was chasing, but he never returned. I would prefer not to, but if Master Halsin does not return, Korga will give the order, and my voice will not matter. Alright, hopefully things work out for you. Yeah, that is dumb. <laughs> a fox looks friendlier than a bear. Okay. <laughs> I'll talk to this boar, see what he's got to say. A hey, boars. <laughs> I thought you were housing. The boar prances around, haunches clenching and unclenching impatiently. Where's housing? He promised me a mate. <laughs> okay. He's only thinking about one thing, huh? Oh, this one right here? Sure. We'll talk to this bird. Shh! I'm concentrating! Does this look good? Is the coin in the middle? <laughs> uh. Uh, trinkets will rust, friend. A song shines on forever. Give it a try. 
Ah. Uh. <clears throat> he lets out a tentative chirp. Gaining confidence, he starts a song, abandoning his nest-building efforts. <laughs> That's awesome. We can loot the uh, nest now. <laughs> Shiny key. Yeah. Um, although the gold is in red, if I take it, they're going to get mad. Uh, if you want to take it, you can. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I agree. Before it's too late. Shadow Hearts just standing in the way. <laughs> Stone door. We can go in there. You go down first, though. I'm sorry. Have you lost your sense? Please. I'm sorry. This is madness, Korga. She's just a a what? Wrath. A thief? A poison? A threat? I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. You see my fucking shitty looking face? <laughs> it's like fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Poison? What's this girl actually done? I mean, she's so young. Girl? You mean parasite? She eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Teela is restless. Come, Korga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. You can always hit R3 too to see your chances on all of that. Try and read her mind. Okay. Oh, boy. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's part of the game. I think there's some inspiration, too, if you want to use it. We got yeah. two inspiration. I think we'll try one. Sure. Try two times if you want. Ouch. Oh. I don't think they want me to use our other inspiration too. Inspiration comes very fast. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Oh, High good. five. Look at that. How sin is gone. I am first druid now. I will take control and prove my authority. Nice. I suppose you've proven your authority, but now you want to prove you have mercy? Fair words. Child, take to the others word of my grace. Sif, sif, Tila, to me! <laughs> it hurts. Thank you, Korga. Master Holsen. Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. Rude. 
I'm gonna talk to Shadowheart real quick. I shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. It's nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least, in case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. Um, how badly does it hurt? <laughs> Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Are you sure it's not connected to the tadpoles? Positive. You can trust me on that. Okay. Oh, sorry. You did well to speak up for the girl. That snake is fickle. A tragedy prevented. I've heard there's some kind of ritual going on? One meant to seal us in. Meant to seal them out. Blasphemous. The Tree Father must see what's happening in his holy grove. Perhaps his eyes are on Master Halsin now. No one's looking for Helsing. Well, I guess I can do it for you. Would you? I would give anything to see Halsing return home. Well, no need to fret. I'll find him. This lady seems kind of dangerous. Sylvanas's blessing upon you, and my gratitude as well. Halsing is an elf with the presence of a bear. He left west with the adventurers. You won't mistake the first druid for anyone else. Hmm. Come, Silver. Stay close. By the way, if you're ever wondering, like, oh, is there something over here? Here. Yeah. Just, uh, markers. <laughs> Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? Kind of. <laughs> I'm the only monster that's got a child. But they don't really need to start a fight with you right now. I understand you're trying to protect your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. First you urge grace, then you speak truth. You surprised me twice over. A shame the grace period ends. The viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm. Free of intruders. Mm, but you can't just force these people out. There's monsters and stuff out there. I am first druid now. I protect the circle, whatever the cost. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to the tiefling leader. Zevlor, he's called. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Well, I guess uh, I best speak to this... Zel Zevlor. Zevlor fellow. You will do more than speak. This tale ends but one way. 
With the Outlander rot cleansed, and the grove forever shrouded. We still gotta talk to Nettie. Uh, Nettie's over here. You can see see how the one where it's like the arrow going up? That's where we need to get out of. The one that's up top to the north, that's where you want to go. I see you. Just give me a moment. This may be Catrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? <laughs> yeah, you picked a tall character. When you were making her, remember? Maybe. You chose the one that was taller? Well, then, I mean, I'm not saying that's a bad thing. Yes, you are. <laughs> Relax, I'm kidding. You found her. But I still don't know what she can do for you. Well, I kind of I need some healing. Maybe ASAP. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. More than tired, uh, something crawled into my eye. Crawled in? Some sort of bug? Or... Wait, did it look like a tadpole? But from your worst nightmare? All slime, teeth, and tentacles? Uh, what do you know of them? Can you help me? <laughs> it's not like a frog hopped in my eye. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I'll do what I can. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. We need to be oh, quick. Very this way. Yeah. Bird looks dead. Sorry, <laughs> that bird does look dead. <laughs> This one had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. I'm hoping for a less grave here. I'll do the best I can. I'm no Master Halson, mind. He'd have your tadpole out like that. Still, we have options. All right. Let's see what we can do. Where's the ring of that? Um, what's, uh, what, what's, what's that for? Is that gonna go? She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Something's off. It might. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? I mean, it might. I mean, what are you... What aren't you telling me? I'm telling you everything you need to know. Believe me on that. I want to help you, but I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? I, 
I don't I, I know uh, nothing strange I just wanted out of my head nothing you sure nothing I'm pretty sure all right I suppose that makes things easier. Give me your arm, please. Okay. Ow. There. Be careful. Your legs will probably give out first. My legs? What kind of cure is this? I'm sorry. Maybe Master Halson could have plucked it from your head. But I can't. Without him here, the only treatment for an illicit tadpole is death. You're a risk to the people around you. I'm truly, truly sorry. For what it's worth, the poison is painless. It'll be like going to sleep. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Why did you poison me? Please, try to relax. This doesn't have to be hard. Is there an animal? You can't have it. I can't risk you turning. You'd kill us all. Would you give me a goddamn antidote? I won't. I can't. Well, uh, but I don't have symptoms. I'm not changing. I swear is it. <laughs> oh. 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 Same as the drow. But Master Halson said he'd turn eventually. Well, if it's. Let me see if I can't get a little closer to you. Oh, I can't. Oh, it's locked. Oh, I'm all alone. Even though he's standing right there. Yeah. Sorry. Well, I mean, eventually, well, that should give me time to find a cure, right? <laughs> that'll help. You're like, I don't want to die. God's above. It's a risk, but maybe you deserve a chance. <sighs> All right. Master Halson did say the drow's tadpole was dormant. Maybe yours is too. Now this is a vial of wyvern poison. It's quick and painless. Swear to me you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Sure, whatever. I hope it doesn't come to that, <laughs> but thank you. Here. And here's the antidote. Do not mix those two up. Yeah, thanks. I spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them, trying to figure out what the hells was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. You must have learned something studying them. For one, that thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from Mind Flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers, telepathic connections, and it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. 
So you think it's only a matter of time? Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected, folks like you, have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. So why don't you go and get him? I've sent birds to find him, but the place is rotten with goblins. And if my birds can't get close, what chance do I have? You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? All right, I mean, I'm already gonna go looking for him, but I will definitely find him now. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Hey, one Captain. step at a time, Nettie. Come on. No time to rest. Pretty bottle. But I wouldn't take wyvern poison even if we do begin to turn. <laughs> There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. I'm sure it'll be very. He's talking about the mind flare <laughs> specimen. Um, it's almost six o'clock. Should we save here and then pick back up tomorrow? Around this time, or not around this time? <laughs> well, either way. Right. I'm gonna do a quick save real quick. A quick save real quick. Yeah. <laughs> Are you gonna do that quickly? Yes, absolutely. Um, let's go ahead and give this a pause. Actually, we can head back to the main menu. Um, let's put the stream ending screen on. All right, everybody. I want to start by telling you all thank you so much for coming and chilling with me and my wife, Miss Lucy. Uh, we had a good time playing some Baldur's Gate. Did you have a good time, babe? It was pretty fun. Kind of funny. Yeah. Yeah, there were some funny moments. You almost died to poison. That was pretty funny. Because oh, yeah. I wouldn't have died, but you would have. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, I could have resurrected you from Withers. Come on now. <laughs> sure. Thank you. Um, but yeah, uh, again, thank you everybody, or thank you everybody for coming out, chilling um, with us. Let's we'll play some Baldur's Gate. So with all that being said, I want to start by telling everybody to have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of, part of the world. Miss Lucy, you want to say goodbye? Bye. <laughs> All right. Mr. John Wayne signing off.